Hey guys, it's Helena here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, I'm going to share with you how you can use ChatGPT to start writing your project roadmaps. ChatGPT has already learned everything on the web and can write in any style, in any format, and it can draw from all of the knowledge that it has learned from all across the web. This is a super powerful tool that you need to start utilizing as a project manager because it's going to increase your productivity and reduce the amount of writing and all of the documentation kind of work that you have to do so that you can only focus on the on the strategic and important task for your projects. So the thing that you have to know about ChatGPT is that the better the instructions that you give to it, the better the results that you're going to get from it. And the process of getting the best results out of ChatGPT is something called prompt engineering. So a prompt is the instruction that you're giving to ChatGPT and the out output is what it's going to return. And today I'm gonna to share with you a great prompt that you can start using to start generating your project roadmaps. And you can download this exact prompt in the descriptions below. Also, if you're new to my channel, please make sure you like and subscribe. Without further ado, let's jump into the prompt now. Here, I give ChatGPT a role. So I told it to imagine that you are a senior product manager responsible for creating comprehensive product roadmap. And then I told it that the roadmap will outline the strategic directions, key milestones, and major initiatives that the product's development that, sorry, the product roadmap outlines the strategic direction, key milestones, and major initiatives for the product's development and evolution. Now, I give it the structure that I want ChatGPT to generate for the project roadmap. I tell it all of the components I want the uh, product roadmap to have. And then finally, I tell it what this particular product is all about. So the different components of the product roadmap would include the product vision, which defines the overarching vision and long-term goals for the product, the market analysis, what the current market landscape looks like and what the customer needs may be, the business objectives, uh, the release plan. This will detail the time frame of when the planned product will be launched, the milestone and timelines, the feature prioritization, prioritize features and initiatives based on the customer's needs. And there are various different techniques you can use to do this, the dependencies, the resource allocation and communication and stakeholder alignment. Finally, here, I also tell ChatGPT to evaluate and iterate. So define the process for monitoring and evaluating the product roadmap's progress and impact and establish feedback loop to gather the user's insight and, and regularly reassess and iterate upon the roadmap here. All right, so all you need to do here is just copy and paste this prompt into ChatGPT. And I put the product here as the product is the creation of iPhones for Apple. And now let's see what ChatGPT will write for the product roadmap. And as we can see, it's only taken a couple of seconds to write all of this. And if we want to refine it further, we can tell ChatGPT the exact section that we don't like and then tell it to expand upon that or some things to fix up in that as well. Also, if your company has a different structure for writing the uh, project roadmap, what you can do here is just take out the components that doesn't uh, suit your project and then add in the components in that your PMO wants to add in. So I hope you found a lot of value out of this tutorial. Again, you can download this prompt below and the main thing you want to keep in mind is the, the way that I'm thinking about how to structure these prompts. I'm giving it a role, I'm giving it a task, and I'm giving it the exact components I want in my prompt, and I'm giving it a tone, a style. And so that is how you can prompt AI to give you better results that you want. Um, and also, if you got some value out of this tutorial, I would really appreciate if you like and subscribe to the channel. That being said, thank you so much, and I'll see you next time.